Hi, my name is Ty Wilson and I play varsity softball and I played varsity for my full four years. Um, I recently signed to continue my softball career at Seattle University where I will be majoring in biochemistry and then I hope to enter the medical field and I plan to become an anesthesiologist. I would like to especially thank Coach T for all that he's done for me throughout the past few years, although all of the coaches for the softball team did leave a mark on my experience. Um, he threw me in my first game of my freshman year and had me in the leadoff and started me in center field, which was really nerve-wracking, but um, all the support from the older girls and all the other coaches continuing to motivate me, I eventually got a lot more comfortable and I had a really good four years and I'm really, really sad to leave everybody, including the classmates and all the teachers that left their marks on me. Um, but I'm really, really excited to make this next step in the next chapter of my life. So um, this is all of the student athletes that have signed to continue playing their sport in college of 2021. Um, we had a little bit different of experience than any other class because our junior years, most seasons were cut short and then we continued on to our senior year, which also was cut short. So the recruiting was a little bit different and adjusting to all of the seasons and the games in your team was a lot more difficult this year, but all of these students have done a great job to continue their education and find another opportunity to continue to play. <laughs> Ty, Coach T, but I uh, got an email the other day saying to uh, do a little video for uh, Ty Wilson. You know me, I got nervous. I looked at it, thought about every excuse not to do it. But bottom line, bud, I feel like uh, I'm gonna do everything in the, that's uncomfortable, everything I don't wanna do, I'll do that for you. That's no doubt, I'll do that for you. I appreciate you. Uh, it's an honor to be your coach for four years. You're a great leader, great role model, great, just, you're a great person, bud. You know what I mean? And I'm just gonna tell you, I don't even know what to say, but I just want you to know that I appreciate you. I leaned on you. I, I put so much pressure on you and you just kept your head down and just didn't say anything, bub. So look, I just want to tell you this. I don't have a whole bunch of like big words and all that stuff, but here's, I'm gonna tell you this. Look, I love you. I appreciate you. I want you to be successful at, in Seattle. And uh, I'm not gonna say goodbye. I'm just gonna say like, I'll see you later because you know in the summertime what we're gonna do. We're gonna get in the batting cage and we're gonna get hit and we're, we're gonna hit, we're gonna get better. That's what we're gonna do. That's the plan, bub. Look, love you, appreciate you, thank you. Hi, I'm Destiny Harris and I just graduated from Vanden High School. I've played on the varsity softball team for four years and it wouldn't have been possible without the support from my teachers and coaches and especially the students who really showed me the ways and made me feel welcome at Vanden and I really was able to push myself to get into La Sierra University which is down in Riverside, California on a great scholarship and I get to study in criminal justice and I'm really excited to go. Hey Destiny, I just wanted to send you a little note but before you go. I just wanted to tell you that I really do appreciate you very much. I want to thank you for b putting in the work with the team, being a great teammate, dealing with all my badgering every single day at practice, every day, critiquing you every day, and you just taking it and just getting better. I appreciate that. Appreciate you. I just like, you know what I mean? I just, uh, I appreciate you just being my friend. Hey, Destiny, good luck to you, bud. I love you, take care, and I'm never gonna say goodbye because I know I'm gonna see you in the summertime. All right, take care, bud, love you, good luck. Hi, my name is Rachel Lynn, and I wanna thank Vanden for giving me this awesome opportunity to play with them for four years. I also wanna thank my coaches, my parents, and my friends for always supporting me, and I'm ready to play for Pacific Union College for the next four years. I'm sorry Coach Chris couldn't be here tonight, However, we both want to congratulate you on your scholarship for Pacific Union College. And we can't wait to hear what great things that you do out there. It has been such a pleasure to have you in our gym these last four years and watch you grow into the wonderful player and human being that you are. You will be greatly missed. We wish you the very best. 
Hi, I'm Asamir at the Kerlock. I'm a senior and I'm going to be going to Miramar California University. But I wouldn't be going there without my teachers and the staff and all my coaches at Mandan. I enjoyed playing volleyball at Mandan these past four years so much. It was the best thing I could have ever done. Um, I'm going to miss it a lot because I built a lot of bonds with all of my friends. And What a special day. Sammy, Coach Chris and I are extremely excited for you and watching you head off to Miramont University is just a pleasure to see you've achieved all the things that you've worked so hard for. We will miss you though, your craziness, your smile, this is just contagious, and the energy that you bring into the gym on a daily basis, um, that's really hard to replace. You are such an amazing person and there are so many great things yet ahead of you and we hope that you think of us as you're making your way through this life and all the pleasure that we had here at Vanden. We wish you good luck. Congratulations. Hi, my name is Maura Braggs and I just want to say thank you to all of my coaches and teachers who have helped me throughout my four years of my high school career. I just want to let everyone know it takes hard work and dedication to get where you want to be in life and I wouldn't be here without any of you guys, so thank you. Hey Maura, Coach Chris and I wanted to congratulate you on this very special event, um, signing for La Sierra University, that's a big deal, and we want you to know what a pleasure it's been and how happy we are that you walked into our gym three years ago. We've seen you work so hard to develop your skills and it's very exciting to see how that has paid off. You are an amazing person and you will be greatly missed and we wish you the very best. Congratulations. My name is Caitlin Reck. I'm going to Sarah Lawrence College and one of the most important things I think for student athletes is setting goals for yourself and staying disciplined both on and off the field. It helps keep you motivated and keeps you focused on what's important and putting yourself on track for reaching the next level of whatever sport you want to play. I want to honor Caitlin Reck. Caitlin played all four years on varsity at high school. Uh, she was captain her junior and senior year. Excellent player, consummate team player, uh, just all around wonderful athlete. Uh, Caitlin will be attending Sarah Lawrence College in New York. Caitlin, good luck to you and we'll miss you. Hi, I'm Paige Valenon and I'm going to Cal Poly San Luis Obispo to play Division One soccer. Um, these last four years have been really, really great. Um, i just like to thank all of the players that I've played with on Vanden and the coaches and my teachers um, and my family members. Um, everyone who supported me, it's just, um, that's the reason why like I got to where I need to be. And um, I just want to th say thank you. And yeah, I'm, I think the most important thing for me um, uh, in being recruited was just remembering that um, I'm a student athlete and that means um, in the classroom and out of the classroom, I'm giving a hundred percent and yeah. Hi everyone, Matt, Athletic Director here at Bandon High School. As you are so proud of, as I'm proud of everyone at the school, of our student athletes who graduate and have athletic scholarships and, and move on. Um, I, not that they're more special than the years past, but they're just a little bit more special, I'll tell you why. They went through a normal freshman and sophomore year. When they got to their junior year, we all know what COVID did to everything. Then this, their senior year, COVID still is playing a part in it. So our seasons were much smaller, less contacts. You had to put in a lot more work. Um, with your skill set, with your sport, and it's less time for scouts and those who recruit over the last two years to, to come and really see instead of just reading numbers. So congratulations. Under all those conditions, um, they are a little specialer. They, I, they had to work harder. They had to overcome these obstacles, and I wish them all the best. And you know, 
as most schools, especially here, are athletic programs educational based. So as you've known and you've heard a million times, you've got to do the right thing in the classroom to even be out there. You have to do twice as good in the classroom. You have to have the, the superior GPA um, so the colleges will recognize you because that means as much to them as their athletic ability. And the reason I'm saying this is, is everybody talks about all the hard work and the athletes and stuff. These girls and boys work harder at home later at night and they hit the books harder because they know it takes two things to do it. Again, congratulations um, to all our student athletes.